Gotta pack everything up, get ready to go, arrive, and then we can get moving. My first day outfit's kind of whack. I'm literally just wearing a Cubs jersey and this. Look, I don't really care for this day because I'm I'm gonna get there at like 6 p.m. So I'm already missed like a mo most of it. So I'm just like got my cool shit ready for Saturday and Sunday. Those are gonna be the awesome days. And I'm pretty sure Ninja's going. I don't know at what time he's going, but whenever he does go, that's gonna be really cool. So pack up, get out of here, go. Let's go pop them. Hey, beautiful. Shout out SeatGeek, by the way. They got me these and one for my friend. You guys know SeatGeek, best place in the world to get tickets for everything. Usually I use them for like NFL, NBA games and stuff, but hey, we got tickets for Lala from SeatGeek too, so you guys have to check out SeatGeek. They're the goats. Oh, and if you use my code MMG, it's $20 off your purchase, so definitely do that. I can't lie though, I'm really not a fan of this outfit for the first day. I think I might switch into this. This is that Miami Heat D-Wade jersey with that nasty colorway. Get naked, nobody look! Oh shit! This is fucking sick! Bro, we just went from zero to 100 real quick. Look at that outfit compared to the other one. Whoo! Yo, this is a big deal too. This is like one of the super fun parts of going to a festival like this. You better look like a fucking stud. I'm kind of all black for this day. Even my skin, as you can tell. So I'm a beautiful dark man. <laughs> Checklist. What does my mom always tell me? Phone, wallet, keys. Where are my keys? Fuck! For real though, this is one of those videos where I feel like when my kids, when I have kids and they're finally old enough to be like conscious, like probably your guys' age, like 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, anywhere around there, and they're like, Dad, like, what did you do when you were our age? Like, what did you do when you were a kid? I can show them this video. I think that'd be sick. So kids, this is what your dad looked like when he was 20. Hopefully you can be a 6'5", 245 beast like me. Honestly, probably won't happen because I am a genetic freak. <laughs> and it's just so unlikely that you'll get all the amazing qualities that I got. But I really do hope, I really do hope you, you turn out not super ugly. Uh, I gotta go, I gotta run back to my house house and get my camel back because apparently you die at, it allows me 93 degrees tomorrow and 90 degrees the day after. And despite how dark and handsome I am, it's the sun's gonna eat me alive. 99.99999% sure I forgot something, but would it be me if I didn't? The feeling I have right now is so, it's so indescribable. It's like anxiety. It's like I'm anxious, but in a good way. Listen to this fucking drop! Three years strong. We're home. Let's find Goose, let's find my mama, let's get my camel bag, let's get out of here. Whose are better, Connor's or mine? Kathy's mine. Y'all don't know shit, this is head ass, this is a librarian, this is a kid who gets pussy. Librarian? Hey! No! Yeah. <laughs> love you. Oh, I love you, Matt. You behave. I don't know, of course. We finally made it, we're ready to get started almost. I got. I'm going straight to the hotel, I'm having him park my car, I'm walking right to Post Malone, and we got here literally almost at six o'clock on the dot, so. Oh, we made it, boys. All right, I don't actually know where I'm going, but presumably I'm just gonna follow the mob of people. All right, I hear a shit ton of music coming from this way, so we're going this way. I'm getting butterflies, bro. Oh my goodness, we finally made it. Kind of, almost, not totally, but we're getting there. All right, entrance is down over here. Post Malone's at Bud Light Stadium, and I actually have a lot of time. Assuming there isn't a massive line to get in, I should be good. Now I gotta go find everybody. I don't think I've ever seen this many people in one area. Oh, I'm getting so anxious, dude. I feel like a goof because I'm walking in totally by myself, but whatever, we're gonna make it. Weather's amazing today. Tomorrow's gonna be 93 degrees. I'm gonna die. And I'm already burnt, so whatever. Welcome to Lollapalooza, boys. Oh my god. Look at how many humans are here. This is fucking unreal. Oh my fucking god. I gotta get water in my pack and I gotta find Bud Light Stadium. That's where everyone is. A lot of people, a lot of outfits. I haven't found anyone with my jersey yet though. So I'm not upset about that yet. Hey, let's go. 
What's up, Chitty? We made it. We made it, boys. We're out here. Around me are familiar faces. Holy shit, we're about to see phones. Shit. All throughout the summer. That's fucking dope. Five nine hour sessions. How many Five, sessions? Nine hours. Perry's talking to myself. Head of some stage called Perry's, which is where Mala and Dylan Francis are gonna be. And then that'll be it for today. This is the big one today. That was fucking sick. Good morning, Lollapalooza well, day numero dos. First day was awesome. I forgot to do a closer on that video, so I might record that now. I saw, I never make outros. I'm sorry to my editors. I love you guys. <laughs>